The Prime Minister's chief Brexit negotiator is a civil servant called Ollie Robbins. He's often there in the background, about six foot four, six foot five, one of the tallest civil servants I've ever clapped eyes on. She thought he was doing such a great job, the Prime Minister, she signed off on a bonus for Mr Robbins of between fifteen to twenty thousand pounds. That's on top of his salary of around a hundred and forty two thousand pounds. So he is being paid the same as the Prime Minister, plus she thought he was doing so brilliantly she gave him a fifteen to twenty thousand pound bonus. He is the architect of the Chequers car crash. In my view, he should be required to give that money back pronto because he didn't deserve it in the first place she shouldn't have signed it off in the first place i thought we were going through a period called austerity i thought there'd been a freeze on public sector pay if you're a teacher a nurse a doctor you'll certainly know all about that and yet mrs may thought it was okay to give mr robbins a twenty thousand pound pay rise a bonus a bonus that's on top of his salary, on top of his pay increase, on top of his gold-plated civil service pension, because he, she thought he'd done such a great job. I cannot recall in 30-odd years covering EU summits ever a Prime Minister being so roundly humiliated as Mrs May was last night in the home of The Sound of Music, one of my favourite musicals in Austria.